Well, hello there. How you doing, everybody? Kasai Battle here. It's my big brother, Bam Bam. Today, we're bringing you guys a special project. Um, well, I've seen it on YouTube. There's plenty of videos out there for it. We're going to eventually take a screwdriver and this truck key, and it's going to have an offspring. So basically, what we're going to do right now, what I'm in the process of doing uh, is we are going to grab this, grind it down to about here, as you can see it marked. Give you a better closer look at that. You can see that. Okay. Yeah. But um, what's going to happen is, is eventually, like, I, like he said, we're going to grind it down. We're going to heat these up, pull the metal rod of the screwdriver out, and while the plastic's still uh, heated and malleable. malleable from the heat from the screwdriver rod, we're going to use that time to try to ram this in and get it in there. and uh, We'll seat it in place and hopefully it, it seals. See That's it the way it showed us in the video. We're going to try it. So uh, we'll come back in a little bit and you guys will get to see what this is, looks like whenever I'm done grinding this down. Anything else? Hopefully we see you then. Be safe and survive. Go. I guess no one knows. I'll turn to the edge side. You can move it over here. You can move it. I can, I can. There you go. <laughs> All right, guys. So we're back, and we have, as you can see, we have our two keys that we're carved down to the size and shape we need to fit them into our nubby handles hmm. of our screwdrivers. And on the one, we may have to carve it down a little bit to make it fit so it looks more professional like it should be a key instead of just a screwdriver handle on it. Now specify, which one are you talking about? You talking and about that would be handle? the one for the door. Yeah, because as you see, we got it specially marked with multiple colored Because there's flicks. a lot of it that sticks out of my door when I put the key in. So it's just going to make it flush yeah. and look more aesthetically pleasing. This now what we're going to do is we're going to heat up the metal rod yes. of the uh, screwdriver, the nubby, which is going to superheat the plastic on the inside of here. And you'll see it to start bubbling out, too. It'll yeah, it'll start it'll, yeah, it'll start oozing out a little bit. Coating out a bit. And once it gets hot enough, we'll be able to pull the rod directly out of the, the nubby handle and... Fit the key right right in, flush right into place, you know, get it all right up in there. Um, now we're going to go ahead and we're going to go superheat this rod and we're going to get it out of here. All right. How you doing, survivors? I'm back 
just wanted to let you know we weren't able to show you guys the handle after we pulled the bracket out but as you can see here's the brackets there's the uh, flat head so you can see that a lot of excess plastic came out with it after we heated and you got the Phillips head right there because since the plat while the plastic was hot we had to hurry up and get the uh, key thrown in weren't really able to uh, show you guys the uh, the handle without the bracket in it so but until we now we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna finally polish off this little excess that happened here from the uh, melting and then we're gonna show you guys we're gonna take you guys outside and show you if they work see you then what's up ladies and gentlemen hi folks we're back we happen to have the finished product and the truck to use it on so let's take a look there you go. see how we had to mold the plastic a little bit we'll explain that in a side video that tells how to do that okay. as we can see folks Okay, now hold on, let me get a shot at the, keep turning, keep turning. As y'all can see, it really does open and close the door. No movie magic here, brah. So, what would you say, brah? You say that is a successful, uh... I'd say this one's a pass. Sorry the truck is such a mess. It almost always is. Oh. And that, folks, will successfully make the cops mad when they see it. <laughs> but it's a pass. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you saw it here. You can successfully turn a pair of screwdrivers into, into car keys. keys. Just gotta try. Human initiative. Work on it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so there you go. That was our video on how to take regular garden variety screwdrivers with of course plastic handles and uh, turn them into car keys now these are the nubbies we are planning on turning these two into house keys but that is going to be a separate video you guys are going to have to stick in to get now if you guys want to see that video let's try to get what do you got? What do you say? Five or ten likes? I'll give me five likes and one subscribe. Hey, there you go. We get five likes and one new subscriber, and uh, we'll show you guys how to turn these screwdrivers into house keys. So, with that... And hey, if you just try it, send us a picture. Yeah, leave us a comment down below. Uh... With uh, any ideas you guys might have for any new uh, projects you might want to see us do. This is basically going to be the start of a new segment that we're going to call Human Initiative. Basically, we're going to take and we're going to solve... We're going to ask the unasked questions. Get the unanswered answers. Of what stupid things can we take, throw together and make something better. Or what we at least think is better. Um, like this, like we said. You know, my brother thought it would be a cool concept to turn screwdrivers into keys. And like he said, there are several, several other videos on, uh, uh, on YouTube of the same thing. So I'm not trying to say we, we, we cornered the market on this. We just thought it was a fun idea. Figured you guys would want to see a video on it. Um, if you don't know of any of the other channels. So... I mean, here you go. But leave us any comments down below on any more ideas you'd like us to conquer. And uh, 
hit the hit the thumbs up button subscribe smash the like button and uh talk to you guys later stay alive